inspired comeback by the Beavers. Well, the Beavers were down 31 to 3 early in the third quarter. 41-34 Beavers. Beavers trying to win it in Boulder on this play. The Beavers with a stop will win. the beautiful front range on homecoming Saturday. It's Pac-12 conference game between the Beavers and the Colorado Buffaloes. Beautiful Folsom Field on the front range. Rockies meet the Great Plains here. Today, we're going to be great. Keeps it, 45, midfield, cuts back, 45, 40, 35, 30, still on his feet toward the left side. The Buffaloes lead it, 30 to 3, 12 seconds into the second half. There, there were a ton of examples of what we are, uh, what we're building here in regards to the ability to respond. We're in this thing together. Everyone can make contributions. Um, there's no back down in regards to, I think, yeah, the deficit we got into. The next guy comes in with, with, uh, with Luton, you know, gives us a spark. The Luton trying to fade route, and it's caught, touchdown! What an effort by Isaiah Hyde! It wasn't until I got to the sidelines, I looked up at the Jumbotron, and I, and I saw what actually happened. And I think Isaiah was standing right next to me, and I just looked at him and was like, dude, that was... Incredible. Like you're, you're SC number one for sure. Top 10. Straight down the middle, but the Beavers get a hand on it, and it's uh, no good. So the Beavers will take over after the blocked field goal attempt. He gets the touchdown. Jack Coletto on the keeper. Touchdown, Beavers. And with 14.30 to play in the fourth, now Colorado 31 and the Beavers 16. I remember uh, like on Friday night prior to the game, Coach Tibbetts said, play your best the game of your career. I feel like a lot of guys clicked on his, clicked on his message and that was something that was, that was like resonating to us and everybody just started playing fast and everyone did their job and I feel like that's what we need to do every game. just can't say it enough how the defense, to hold those guys to three points really the last half hour of that game was huge. We had a handful of guys on defense, and obviously I haven't been here a long time for their entire careers, but we had a bunch of guys on defense that played their best game of the season on Saturday. There was at one point we were down, down a couple scores with nine minutes or so, and, and I just looked at the guys, you know, a couple of receivers, and just said, you know, we can make this thing happen. We can do this. And Fake to Jefferson. Pass on the inside slant. Caught by Isaiah Hodgins. Touchdown, Beavers. Was 7-13 to play in the game. Colorado 31, the Beavers 26. 34-28, yeah, 205 to play. Luton to throw again. Colorado dials up for pressure. A shot for Hernandez down the left sideline. Timmy goes up and makes the catch. First down, Beavers inside the Colorado 10. Luton, the throw for the end zone. Caught! Touchdown, Beavers! Travon Bradford! And the Beavers have tied it up. The clock does run out. So the clocks go to zero and we go to overtime. 34-34 in Boulder, Colorado. An inspired comeback by the Beavers. Coletto runs right. Coletto looks for the lane. Coletto gets in. Touchdown, Beavers. Well, the Beavers were down 31-3 early in the third quarter. 41-34 Beavers. Beavers trying to win it in Boulder on this play. The Beavers with a stop will win. Steven claps his hands, takes the pass from center. Montez looks, throws, batted up, incomplete! The Beavers win! The Beavers win it in overtime. The final score, the Beavers 41, Colorado 34. The, the players' faces and, and being a, a part of 
seeing them have some success. I mean, that's why you coach. You want to see these guys improve and have some success. And so for them to be able to experience it and to feel like you had a part of that, it was something that, uh, you know, brings joy to you. And uh, exciting, uh, again, appreciative. And uh, it, was, it was something I won't forget. Life, like everything's not gonna go your way, but the one thing you can learn, take away from everything, is just keep fighting, you know, until you actually get it, you know. So that's one thing I could take away from that, and just keep fighting every day, and just keep staying positive, and keep working hard, and you know, and the positive things, the good things that will come, they just gotta just keep working.